Welcome back, tubers. Uh, welcome again to another uh, unedited, unscripted, raw, naked video stream of conscience ramblings and jaw jackings from Dr. Jet. Anyway, uh, we're here in the Stink Bug Works, the super secret research and design development division of Dr. Jet Laboratories, and I thought I'd let you know what's going on. I've been working on, oh, far too many guitars. And I haven't had a chance to work on the 12-inch challenge. So um, I'm getting ready to uh, mix up some epoxy. I've now got this thing on my uh, setup board, and I'm ready to glue in these members here that will go into the uh, sponsons. So as you can see, everything fits i'm here on my setup board i have four degrees here i have one and a half degrees here everything's copacetic so we're gonna mix up some epoxy and uh, epoxy these puppies in while i'm mixing up epoxy it's also time to put the ride plates here on the uh, sponsons for Prototype number two, the uh, the full-bodied version. Yeah, like my wines, sometimes a full body might be better. We'll see. I'm wondering what's going to be lighter. Remember, this one's built out of basswood, which is heavier than balsa. So it's going to be interesting to see which is lighter, which is stronger. This thing's going to be stronger in terms of flex and so forth. Uh, this one may be stronger. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. So um, I've got some carbon fiber. I'll get a bigger piece. Carbon fiber to make a, a rudder. You saw how I'm going to mount the servo with a, a cable. I'm going to fill in one of these bays with a sheet of balsa, and I'll run the the cable out that bay and then I'll actually let the cable extend a little beyond there and what I'll do is uh, I'll cover it with the monocoat then slit it to get that cable out run the cable out and then put a little uh, goop around that opening to seal that and that'll be how I do that and then I'll just uh, generously lubricate or grease the uh, the cable so that'll all be uh, copacetic um this is a commercially available ebay thing micro turn fin and it looks like it may work i might have to m set it a little deeper but i'm gonna start with this turn fin and you know turn fins it's a piece of metal and you bend it how easy is it that so um uh, I'll probably wind up making a turn fin that's just the the height I like, but we'll see. I don't need a whole lot digging in, so we will see. So there's what I'm up to this week. Um, I was going to go out to the lake tomorrow, Monday, but I'm working on something. I... I design a lot of prototype stuff, and some of it never sees the light of day. This is a 16-inch catamaran that's based on a design that's been around for a long time. Uh, a fellow I know took that design, and he kind of put a little more angle on the sides here and changed some deck features, and... I drew it up in AutoCAD. There were a couple of changes from, you know, scratch building and, and cutting it on a belt sander versus, you know, the two thousandths of an inch precision I need for AutoCAD. Uh, uh, um, there were some glitches up here with this bulkhead. But uh, anyway, this was a twin motor version of it. And I just wasn't real happy. I was going to use these common struts and I... Don't know if I could get the struts low enough. 
so this is sitting on the back burner, but why I brought this out was to tell you I do have a single motor version of this, which I've actually run a couple of times, but I had the CG too far forward and the motor was sitting here and I had this big, huge brick of a speed control in this compartment and had the batteries up here. Well, I've since moved the batteries back, brought this speed control back and put a smaller one in. And here's what I'm going to do. In this boat, in the single motor version of this, I am going to put in a motor. Actually, I've already done it. It has a motor and a speed control that are both over 25 years old. That's right. I'm putting a brushless motor and brushless speed control in this single engine version of this. And I'm putting in a 25 year old power system. Why? Because I think it might be better than anything that's currently available today. Uh, until next time, Jet out.